Hello my little storm crabs and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here today I'm going to show you how to create these loft rooms they are super easy and anybody can do them you don't need any cheats or anything on for this it is that easy so once you've got your room built so I've just got a general room here I haven't finished this this will be a, this will be a speed build at some point that I will put up and I will upload this to the gallery because I said I would before and I just never got around to it I deleted the original room um, after filming it was just like one that I made really quick and then everybody wanted me to upload it so I will upload this once I am done so I've got my base of my room made and I know this bit might change but that doesn't matter because this is the main bit we're focusing on is above this area I've already built it I just need to make a bathroom so what I'm gonna do is page up because we want to create another room on top of here and you can make it the exact same shape as what you've got going on here or say you just wanted to do this shape um, it is totally up to you on what you want to do. I'm going to do it this shape. Um, I sort of want this little bit jutting out to give some interest, but you don't have to do that. You could do the whole shape. It really does not matter. So now you want to pick the fence that you want to use to be your edge. You can go ahead and change the fence afterwards. It really doesn't matter. It's really easy to change them. So just pick one that you want or just a really basic one if you can't think of which one you want yet. So I want to use this one from Get Together. I really like it. And I want my room to cut off here. So I'm just going to draw across like that. Now to have the open section, what you want to do is click on the room and click again and you'll get this remove floor option and it will just remove the floor as long as this is set as a room. So once you've drawn the thing in, it is a full closed off room. You might have to double check that it is a room. If it's not, you might have to like redraw the room. Sometimes that is an issue. And now we do have this area here. And you just need some stairs up here. So I'm just going to pick some stairs. I'm just going to pick some stairs. It doesn't really matter which ones you pick because you can change them afterwards again. And you just place them into the fence that you can see, which is going green. It will just remove the fence for you. And now we have something like this. And you can adjust the size of the room afterwards. You'll just need to place your stairs back in, like if you wanted it further back or something like that. You can do that nice and easy. So yeah, it's really, really easy to make loft rooms. They're really, really basic. I know sometimes I do lofted beds slightly different. That is when I'm trying to build a tiny home. I want a minimal amount of squares possible, whereas this is gonna add extra squares on top. You could, because we've removed this part of the floor, you can see it was 100 tiles, now it's down to 75 tiles because I'm making this a small home. I'm gonna go ahead and place a bedroom up here and I'll be back. But that is it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and I will see you in my next one. Bye.